<laughs> what the part? <laughs> I think I hate you. Hate. Hate is a strong word. And I, I seldom, I seldom use it. But you sit there as comfortable as you are. I do so much work for you. I wire everything together. I gather all these moving parts. And I provide opportunity after opportunity for safety for you. And you stay silent? Can't light a fire to let me know you can hear me, or can't reach out to let me know I'm not alone. Of course not. Of course not. Of course not. My work here is just for you to distract yourself for a brief, and I mean brief, moment. Let... Let someone else struggle for a bit, and you listen and choose to ignore the small asks I have. Let's, let's, let's run the checklist, shall we? I essentially, I build a radio studio to make sure people can hear me, figure out how to broadcast AM, FM, CB simultaneously. Find, find food, uh, brave the, the the atrocity that is what is a grocery store nowadays, the smell alone could kill you. And I go in, I venture it, I brave it, and I make little packets of, of, of stations of food for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Attacked, attacked by crows, or ravens, or whatever the hells they are! And then, and then, when I truly, truly feel alone, I find some other survivors, people! Like us, who have survived whatever the event is that caused all of this, opened my doors, and then I opened my doors to them, and they take advantage of me and steal everything I had. Then again, it's not over. No, it's never over, is it? Then again, I left alone with no signs of being told my work is appreciated. Nothing I do is right for you! Then, then, when I'm at a low point, trying to move forward because I have never been so low in my life, I am attacked again by one of the violent ones out there. We could have stopped this together. I carry this stupid crowbar now with me wherever I go. It's stained, stained permanently with brains and black ichor. If I leave it behind, as I go about my day, my heart is filled with shame and guilt. And it's so overwhelming, I can think nothing, but I need it back in my hands right now. So when it's by my side, and I have it in my hand, and I can feel the cold metal... I know what I am. I know what I am. I have my brand as a monster to prove it. And you sit there comfortable, guilt free. You, <laughs> you, you. You make me so mad. I have to do all of this alone. In silence with my own thoughts. You know, 
<laughs> you know, you know, you know how hard it is to have a catharsis of words when no one can hear them. Therapy is pretty useless with no one to validate your words. I don't know which betrayal has been worse, to be honest. Eileen and Brett, or the silence and loss of hope from you. <laughs> A total stranger. <laughs> I I am so livid right now. I gotta think. I ah, uh, think, Gabe. Think. <laughs> uh, thinking is the thing I do so well. Remember, remember that when this all started. <laughs> what am I supposed to do? I know I'm not alone. I I know that. It's been proven. How did how 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 did this happen to us? Where where's the royal military to step in and drop safe houses, safe zones, and food? Rest the control from me. I I am begging you. Maybe that's what I need to figure out. I know. I know. I'm not some sort of archaeologist or some smart man who can discover the secrets of your local government and the stupid conspiracy theories. But something had to happen to cause this. Yeah, maybe. Maybe that's the best path for me to go on. Maybe <laughs> drop the microphone for a bit. It's an unhealthy relationship I'm building between you and I. Gather up as much detail as I can. Figure out what happened and then work backwards from there. Find what made me immune, made us <laughs> immune. <laughs> Despite <laughs> regard <laughs> Look <laughs> What I'm trying to say Is that even though I am so mad I can only see red You <laughs> Still aren't alone You never were I won't... I won't be at the college or the stadium for a while. God knows how long. I need to, I need to stop making myself vulnerable for a bit. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, totally. You get it. You get it. If you do need to be found... Well... You can figure out a way for, uh, for me to find you, I guess. You could, you could figure that out on your own, really. You, you really can. It's about time you did a little bit of work in this relationship that we've got. I'm going to go back to what I know. Facts. Research. Data. Information. Devil's in the details. That's what they say. And I, I intend to find him. And just remember, you aren't alone. <sighs> and until you hear from me again, my name's Gabriel Blythe.
good luck out there.